Alright. Hello, everyone. Hello, hello. Welcome back. Week 7. Week 7. UNPL. Time flies when you're having fun. Uh, so today, we are playing against... What's his name? Hold on. Let me register my team first. Then I'll tell you who he is, his team, what I'm afraid of. Obviously, you guys see the six that I think he's going to bring on the bottom. Six I'm bringing are Aang, Driftlim, Bossing, Say the Fortress, Sokka, the Chin Pao, Tarlock, the Ursuline Blood Moon, Suki, the Sneasler, and Tai Lee, the Okapan. Is that right? Yes. Okay. Can you tell him I'm searching? Telling we're searching, so we should find him in just a second. Let me load up the damage calc. And alright. So we're playing Arsenal MC and the Hall River Hound Dooms. His team is the Mouse Parada, the Urshifu, Rapid Strike, Delphox, Hydreigon, Klefki, Gengar, Landorus, Electros, Colossal Hound Doom, and Grovile. Alright, we find him. His hair captains are the Delphox, the Electros, and the Colossal. Um, I'm not gonna lie. This is the first battle I feel like I might lose. Um, all right, so let's see what we got right. We got the cat, Urshifu, Gengar, Landorus. All right, so he doesn't bring Klefki and he doesn't bring Hydreigon. So we can delete them. And we have to add Delphox. And the electrodes. Mm -hmm. The box is there. And the electrodes. We got plenty of time. We got 45 seconds. Okay. Alright. So looking at it, uh, Scarf Gengar would be a slight issue. Um, Dragon is pretty nice. Um, I think I. Alright. So, obviously, I may just lead with the Chim Pal. Um, or the. Oh shit. Oh no. Fuck. Whoops. Ah, uh, fuck. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna restart real quick. Real quick, we're gonna we're gonna restart here. Um, I'm gonna pause, and I will be right back when we are back. We're gonna leads and everything. I just I'm gonna rank six Pokemon. All right, we are back. I brought six Pokemon this time, so he's gonna lead the Delphox. Um, now I ended up bringing. Play rough on my ogre pawn instead of knockoff, I believe. So that's a bit of an issue now, because I wish I had. Um, knockoff is Delphox. So ogre pawn, heart, heart, uh, flame versus a Delphox. Alright, so. If. So nothing he's gonna do is gonna kill me. Um, you turn. Oh, what the fuck! Why does power punch is it just two to KO? Um. Well, if he Terra fires, right? He is Terra fire. Yeah. So if he goes Terra fire, fire less into a whole lot. Um. If he Terra fires, there's still a chance to kill him. Uh, two power ups. I'm gonna click power up. Fuck it. We're gonna see what happens. We're gonna stay in. We're gonna do a lot. Oh my god. Oh crit. See, that's why the risk is sometimes worth the reward. We're gonna take a psychic. Right? Oh, that psychic did a lot. 
Psychic. Psychic did one. So he's in smogus, I guess. Okay, so, um. Honestly, right here. I think, well, the crit did. The crit power whip did a little less than that, so he's gotta be some type of bulk. Let's say he's max HP. If he's max HP, I don't think an Ivy Cudgel will kill, but he doesn't have a great switch in for a power whip. Um, I'm just gonna click it again, get our free damage off on whatever comes in. He switches, so he doesn't have a free power whip. I was almost gonna go for U turn, but U turn didn't kill. So Gengar's gonna come in. Oh my god, we are just destroying things. Okay. Um, now the problem is if this Gengar is scarfed. Um, I am max job, so if he's not scarfed, it's just gonna be a speed tie. Um, so I think. I think here I might just click Ivy Cudgel. Playing so recklessly with this uh, Okapon. Um, uh, I mean, I think Ogrepan has done most of what, I mean, I mean, I'm max speed. If he outspeeds me, okay, so he's probably Spark, which I assumed he would be. So what I can do is if he's scarfed, how much does he do to drift blim? I have two options here. So Sludge Mom is doing 31 to us. But if he shadow balls, he can kill us. So if he isn't scarfed. Um how much does Sludge Wave do to Sneasler? Sludge Bomb would break our sub. I'm gonna go Ursul Luna. So even if he's not choice, we um, we can take a we can take a Focus Blast. Um, I think I'm gonna click Earth Power here. Land race would be an issue, but I don't think he would do that. I just want to click Blood Moon and not be able to click it next turn. So I'm going to click Earth Power here. I just... Okay. So he gives me the Gengar. Okay, cool. So now, nothing else beats Drifflin or... Oh. Just Drifflin, really, because it's easily out. It's about everything anyway. So he was Scarf. So obviously... Going into our Saluda was the play um, instead of letting Ogre Pond die, but it is all right. It is all right. I think we have a good chance to win. Um, all right, now, so what I did learn, our Saluda. So if I am versus this Urshifu. Urshifu. So Bandit would kill me. If he's not Bandit, uh, there's a very small chance that I would die. Um, I, however, have a Fortress for this situation. I'm gonna go in. I'm gonna get my Rocky Helmet. I'm gonna hope he clicks Surging Swipe so we get three rounds of Rocky Helmet. And we'll see if he's Bandit, so. So he goes for the Surging Strikes. Crit. Okay, so he's not like punching low or anything. So he's gonna hit us three times. So 38 to 39 would be. Alright, so he does. One seventy-five. It does just about half. Um I mean, will I give up my fortress for this? Like what's gonna come in here? Um, it could be Lando, maybe Delphox. Uh, he does not have a spinner. 
I think I just click rocks here. You can't get rid of them. And if he goes Delphox, then I get my rocks up. And Delphox can't heal itself anyway. And if he stays in and kills me, then I'm just taking another half of his health to the... Yeah, so that's fine. So he is banded. Um, maybe Mystic Water can get him there. Yeah, it's a Delphox comes in. Figured as much. Um, let me see. Mystic Water. No, it has to be. It has to be Choice Band for him to do that much. Choice Band. Yeah, okay. So, I'm going to... Since Gengar is dead, there's Luna. Um, I wonder if I can take two Psychics. Or, well, Fire Blast. And the Del Fox. I can? It does get Willow Wisp though. Well, why do I care? I'm a special attacker. Uh, I don't believe Delphox gets Focus Blast. It may. It may. Oh, he goes for Witch. I didn't know Delphox got Witch. Um, well. I mean, honestly, I click Blood Moon and I pick up any single kill that I wish. Um, looking at what he's got left. Nothing takes a blood moon. And once if he protects to heal, uh I can click Moonblast pretty free. Or like he's gotta switch out because he still dies with earth power. But um Oh he's gonna withdraw. Oh what am I killing? Give me this blood moon. Landers? That thing's gotta die for sure, surely. Maybe if they use either okay, he's trying to pre predict the earth power. Predict the Earth power, but we're not we're not here. We're not playing these little games. We're gonna blow them. And we're gonna take it out. Let's go. We burn the wish as well, um, so there is no wish coming down, which is great. Uh, this battle's looking, looking all right. I should have should have went to Ursa Luna on the Gengar, but you live and you learn. It's it's all right. So he's gonna go Meowscarada now. Yo, Scarada. If he is, right, I'm just gonna go to Fortress on this. I believe. Need some Rocky Helmet. Because the Ursula can still come in on um, Electra, so he can cut Flower Trick. He doesn't have a Volt Switch switch in now. So, with the Landers being gone, so I just get up a free Volt Switch. He can stay in, do whatever he's gonna do. Now he can't change types again, so he's locked into being a dark. Um, I wonder if he gets any poison moves. So he's gonna withdraw, I'm gonna get a free bolt switch. What's he going into? So he's gonna go into the Delphox. Um, Drift Blim. No, sorry, not Drift Blim. Uh, the Yoskarada. Now I wonder, so this guy's revealed Psychic and a Wish. Now, I just don't know how I'd get my... I couldn't proc my key berry off of this, so I don't think I really want to go into it. Um, so I'm thinking... I can probably go into... Yeah, I'm just going to Chien Pao, I think, here. Um, and I'm gonna click a free crunch. Urshifu is at about half after you know after rocks. Um, I'm sure he dies to a psychic fang. Alright, so I don't have sucker punch, I have crunch. I'm silly. That's okay. Uh Chin Pao. Mm -mm -mm. Versus a Del Fox. Does plenty with Icicle Crash. So he switches. He's not gonna switch. He's gonna give me the Delphox. Alright. 
Delphox down. We're down. We killed three of his Pokemon, and one of them's Electros, which I'm really just not worried about. It's just his uh, Meowskarada, Urshifu, and Electros left. Uh, Urshifu comes in. Now, he is... I mean, he may... I, I'm not absolutely positive he's banded. But I don't think he ever could have done that much to a fortress if he was Scarf. So he may be some boosting at it, but I'm, I'm fairly positive he wasn't Scarfed. Urshifu, I'll just check one more time. God, I can't spell it. How much time do I have? 30 seconds? Okay. So Urshifu Rapid Strike Choice Band. Yeah, if he wasn't banded, there's just no way he was getting that much damage. So a Chien Pao, Psychic Fangs should be enough to take this thing out. It absolutely is. Q Pyapa Berry. No. So Chien Pao is going to pick up another kill. Um. Meowskarada is going to come in. Um, now, all we've seen it click was... Um, oh, wait, he's... Okay, so he's boots. Alright, cool. So we're going to click Crash. If he sucker punches, that's fine. So he's boots. We outspeed this. We should. As long as I spend correct correctly. It's gotta be boots because he didn't take rocks. Okay, we take out the Meowskarada. And then after this, I think it is just the eel. And Gianpad does. Electros. Um, I mean he gets Drain Punch and it would kill me. So. I'm not going to give him a free kill. Uh, I mean, his dream punch is probably not doing that much there, so I'm not going to just not keeping my differential. I'm not letting Chimp out back. So we're going to go out into our Ursa Luna. He's probably going to click Dream Punch. You guys are discharged. Okay. That didn't have the drink. Uh, I'm gonna click Blood Moon. Gonna do good amount. Good amount. He's gonna give you drain. He's not gonna heal that much. Um, I'm gonna click Moon Blast and then another. Blood Moon afterwards will take him out. We're clicking Moon Moves only. Drop a special attack, too. That's pretty nice. But I don't think he had much of a chance. So we're going to take down the Electros and wrap up another 5-0 victory. Could have been a 6-0 if I just went with my gut and swapped out into the... Um, swapped out into the... What's it called? Or Saluna on the Gengar. I mean, I knew he was going to be Scarf. There's no way he brought that thing in to risk a speed tie or be slower than me. Uh, so either way, we're going to improve to 7-0. 7-0, him and his sleepy roaring moon. The rest of his Pokemon are kind of sleeping, too. Thank you, everyone, for watching on this undefeated journey. Uh, next week, let me give you guys a little preview. Doc wants to look. So week 8. We are going to be against Dashing Sceptile, who is one of the, um, I believe he is, I think he's two and five. So again, we don't underestimate our opponents around here, um, but we are looking forward to our undefeated season. And obviously I'm going to, whoops, I hit the wrong button. Uh, I'm gonna keep making sure I play every game like it's the finals. We're gonna get, we're gonna go as hard as we can for 9-0 and winning the championship of this league. I will see you guys back here next week. Take care, brush your hair, goodbye.